penjenamaan ni ialah sesuatu identiti uh, untuk satu produk, um, service ataupun bisnes. Um, jenama ni, which is also branding, ya, uh, boleh uh, kita lihat dari segi simbol dia ataupun uh, tanda. Um, sometimes you boleh fikirkan kalau you tengok sesuatu tu tak perlu ada nama, you tengok tanda tu, you dah tahu atau simbol tu ataupun color. Um, so that is sebenarnya penjenamaan tu uh, di mana consumers um, have some sort of macam relationship dengan produk tu so nama tu penting kalau tak ada jenama it's it's difficult for um, any product or service to move forward um, sesuatu um, produk tu perlu menjalani uh, audit ya yeah? ataupun service tu kita mesti do a brand audit. Kita nak tahu dari segi perception, persepsi uh, consumer tu bagaimana uh, mereka melihat sesuatu produk ataupun servis itu. Um, the audit nanti itself will tell you where are the pain points. Ramai yang fikir jenama ni ialah logo ataupun simbol saja. Uh, but sebenarnya jenama ni goes deeper than that. Yeah, it could be um, the brand culture itself. Yeah, sesuatu Uh, company itu. Uh, kalau dari segi produk tu, um, apa yang uh, consumer tu melalui uh, dari segi produk, okay? From the packaging, kalau packaging tu cantik ataupun uh, packaging tu is very user friendly, so it it builds the brand. Ya, yeah, kalau service tu, it's about taking the consumer through a journey, through an experience. Mulakan branding tu daripada sekarang. Jangan fikir Uh, lepas a uh, couple of years then saya rasa oh then only saya nak invest in branding because branding takes time um, you you have to create that trust in your your customers yeah that your brand is good and you're able to deliver your brand so you want customer loyalty at the end of the day and you also want to show your brand differentiation yeah apa yang unik berkenaan dengan brand